Alright. Hello, everybody. How's everybody doing today? I hope everyone is having a great, safe, three, three day Labor Day weekend in the fjord. That's great. So, today we're going to be talking about is spiders located in Australia. Now, they're a little bigger and a little bit different. So, I don't really like spiders, really, so I'm going to really, but uh, I'm going to give a little, I'm going to try something different, like talk about it. There's not that much, but we're going to start from the top and then go from the bottom. All right. So, the first one is a funnel web spider, a mouse spider, and the third one is a trap door spider, a white tailed spider, a harvest, a harvest. Thin man spider, tarantulas, red back spiders, atrax, rope chest, the pona, scylla, solitarina, a recluse spider, a black house spider, a common guard, garden orb web, orb weaver, weaver spider, a wolf spider, and a red back one. Now, I'm so sorry I can't, I can't really pronounce some of them really well. They have very weird names. So, if you want to, want to know what a, a mouse spider does, or what they are, okay. Red-headed mouse spiders, they have a have smooth, glossy, like, carp pace in their head area. is high, step, and, and broad. And very large, barbarous jaws. And uh, let me see if they're dangerous or not. The mouse ones. Mouse spiders. Let me see how dangerous they are. If they are dangerous. Are they poison? Well, I just found out that they are... Some mouse spiders have very toxic venom, which is potentially as dangerous. That is of the Sydney funnel. The Sydney funnel web spider. Although not normally not aggressive, the male spiders will bite if provoked and should be considered dangerous too to humans. And the other one is, are they harmful? The bad news is that mouse spiders are quite venomous, although they're never caught they never cause any deaths. They have a pretty nasty bite and there's some evidence that their venom could be almost dangerous as on a web venom. Like the differences. So can they and how long do the mouse spiders live for? The lifespan of mouse spiders are very varieties of species but average they can live for is several years female spiders generally live longer have have longer lifespans than the males so they have a better chance of living than more than the males and that was just an notification on my phone sorry Let's go. Let me try to go back. And uh, a trap door spider. The bite of a trap trap door spider is very low risk, non toxic to humans, while very while not very dangerous. Local pain and swelling may occur if if you get bitten by them. So trap door spiders. May, Miss a goal is Rapex trapdoor spider's appearance often confuses with the funnel web spiders with the brown. A small, neat hole lined with a, uh, a collar of silk, which does not extend more than a centimeter from the rim of that could belong to a trapdoor spider. The common brown like recluse. Let's look up a brown 
Let's look up a uh, trapdoor spider. Trapdoor spider. Here, I'll show them real quick. See, they're very tiny. They're very small looking. But let me see if, if they are venomous or if they're harmless. Are they poisonous? Venom toxicity. The bite of a trapdoor spider is low risk. Non toxic to humans. It's not an aggressive spider, usually timid, but may stand up and present its fangs if harassed. Rarely bites, but if so, it can be painful. Trapdoor spider bites hurt. They're usually very shy and usually flee from any threat, although males may rear up if startled. Trapdoors have large fangs, which may cause a painful bite with some swell pain and swelling. However, their bite is not dangerous, but it's a good idea to if you give spiders a bit of space if you can. Because they hate humans. They're more scared of you than you are of them. Because we're huge than them. We intimidate them a lot. That's why I. So uh, that's all I wanted to talk about right now. The spiders located in Australia. And uh, the thing is, if, if you see them, just leave them alone and they will leave you alone. So um, chances are they, some will scurry away from you because they hate humans. And they don't want to be around any any humans at all because they are um because they're scared and we're much more bigger than them we tower over them so like twice their size but if we provoke them if you get if they get pissed off if you notice the hissing that means they're telling you that they're mad or they're telling you to go oh but they some may chase you but some may don't want to chase you some don't want to be seen they don't want to be seen at all some are really good at camouflage and all that. But that's all for now. That's all I wanted to talk about. The spiders located in Australia, what kinds they have. It's, it's a little short going from the top into the bottom. But that's okay. It's, at least I got something today. A little topic to talk about. What, what animals they have in, located in Australia. So, um, yes. I hope everyone has a three-day weekend. Hope everyone has a safe one. And also, I know I will, but I hope everyone has a great few days. And um, and I'll um, I'll put some more content up up for now, but it won't be for a while. And then I'll give an update about what I did for my three-day weekend if what animals I find or what other locations I find for to travel around the world. So that's all for now. I got to go. So until next time, have a great three-day three weekend and take care of yourselves. Okay. Bye-bye.